Okay, so here's an idea, right? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Tekka 2, but my mining is slow, right? I, I, I've been... What the heck? How did I mention that? That was weird. Um, so I, I've been figuring out my mining is super slowly recently. I'm going to up it. So I looked into what our options are, right? We have uh, the mine drills from IC2 are actually a really good option, right? So we need three batteries, right? Uh, that is tin, redstone, uh, iron, or no, copper, not iron, right? Copper and rubber. So we, we make this, right? We make the copper wires. Don't need a ton of them. We only need a few of them. Just enough to, you know, last us forever, hopefully. Um, oh, I need that tin still. We don't need the copper anymore, though. I don't, or that rubber, really. Uh, now what we want to do is we want to make the, the re-battery. Right, that's good. And we want to we get some reinforced iron out of here. Oh, We want to take you, make an electronic circuit. And then with that, we make ourselves a drill, right? That's nice. The drill is a charge, right? We can use it to, to do whatever, right? But why don't we just take uh, some diamonds, right? And make it into a diamond drill immediately. Right? And now this drill is going to be infinitely better. Just because now it can use a... Uh, it combines stuff with the diamond here, right? Well, this is really good. Right? So all we got to do is we actually got to come back here. We got to chuck you into the charge slot here. Right? It's going to start pulling some... EMC out, or not EMC, uh, EU out of the bat box. EU's the industrial crap power, right? And now all I gotta do is I guess gotta head down to the mines where I used the destruction catalyst earlier, right? And mine up what I did. So that's that's the goal right now. It's like, you know, this is all very, you know, out of nowhere, but like, I wanna do this on camera instead of off camera because it's make life a heck of a lot easier, right? Because what? Watch slow. And how much faster is this? A little bit faster. Uh, there's another tier above this that we're not quite at yet. And I'd like to also be able to carry more battery around on me because this is actually going to drain pretty fast. But the next tier up is the advanced diamond drill. And that's what we're going to be working towards today. It's going to need advanced circuits, overclockers, and realistically, this isn't the hardest thing to craft. It's just that I want to get some more EMC before I craft it because it's going to end up taking, uh, well, it's going to end up taking a lot of resources in the end, so... That's just what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get a little bit more, you know, EMC before we do it because I want to have a pretty stable pool. So we're going to see how fast this drains. And if it does drain really quickly, which I feel like it's going to, then we're going to actually have to, like, you know, figure out, you know, a way to keep it powered because you can see this is draining really quickly. Um, we're already about, yeah, we've already gone through a good amount of blocks that this can, this can dig up. Because we mine the gold here. Got to get rid of this last piece of gold. Break out of here. Right? So we, we're gonna have to figure out exactly- well, it's, it's actually doing quite well. I'm gonna have quite a bit of blocks. And the next one's gonna be even faster, so... Uh, this is actually doing pretty good. All things considered. Right now, it's going pretty well. I mean, it could be- it could be better. It could be, it could be fast, number one. And I- I mean, it, it's mining up a good amount of blocks, but it's not mining up an amazing amount of blocks before it's gonna be dead. I can tell. Yeah, I like this to last a little bit longer before I have to recharge it, number one. And yeah, I definitely would like it to have be a little bit faster. Of course, I can enchant it, but that's, uh, you know, the, the vanilla way of doing things. And once I enchant it, I'm not going to have the ability to upgrade without basically making a new tool from scratch. Because if we try to upgrade, it's going to lose its enchants. So, yeah, definitely we're probably going to want to do it this way. But, you know, through IC2 first, instead of trying to go around and enchant the item first. Because this is basically... Mining up one or two more items. Yeah, now it's out. So, okay, cool. Let's go upgrade this the IC2 way. Okay, we want this advanced diamond drill. We're gonna need advanced circuits, which are gonna need electronic circuits. Wow, that's not bad. Um, So, we're gonna need to grab you. Probably gonna need that in the future. So, uh, we're gonna need, I think, redstone. I believe glowstone. Uh, I believe lapis. Lapis. And a reinforced iron. Uh, it's just not reinforced iron. It's refined iron. Sorry, not reinforced. Um, so yeah, you guys are going to require electronic circuits. So that gets us those two. Which we get for the uh, advanced electronic circuits. Cool. Now we need the overclockers. I guess we're actually going to need two overclockers in each spot. Which is weird. But okay, so that's going to be 
10k coolant cells, which are going to be the, the, the not fun part of this. So we're going to need six electronics, six more electronic circuits, so we'll get that out of the way. Get ready, copper, then. Because, uh, yeah. Copper with rubber. There we go. Again, give me more electronic circuits. One, two. Oh, I didn't need to make the advanced ones. Oopsies. These got to go back. I got, well, I can't uncrap, you know, the advanced ones, so oopsies. I have some advanced ones in reserve for a rainy day of some kind. I don't know. That was a mistake on my behalf. Oopsies. Um, yeah, so overclock we need 10k swollen cells. We're gonna need oh we could do the Evertide amulet. And I just run that. Okay, wait. So we could do water cells, right? Or we could just do the Evertide amulet. That's gonna need dark matter. I mean we can make dark matter. And then we get to start back in here. So yeah, yeah, let's do this. Um dark matter is gonna be expensive. Uh diamond. But yeah, I think I think this will make life easier if this is just temporary. Because we're going to need to make block a diamond. Right? So we can do that. So diamond. So what was it for the Evertide Amulet? It's going to be dark matter. So surrounded by 8 or now fuel. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, cool. Do that. Do this. You got a piece of dark matter, right? I throw all you back in there, definitely can do that. And then it's going to be water. So one, two, three, four, five. Oh, I think it's six, right? Yep. Okay, cool. So now we can make the Evertide Amulet, right? Throw you in there, throw you in there. So Evertide Amulet's really expensive, but that's fine. So if we wanted to make the 10 k cool one cell, it's going to be tin, right? So I got a few... Uh, I don't know how many of these we're going to need. Let's do some math here, right? So, uh, I guess I don't need that anymore. But, okay, so we need two, two each, right? So, that is a 10k coolant cell. So, that's one per. So, we're going to need 14 per, per three. So, we need six of these. So, we're going to need six times four is 24, right? So, we need 24 10. That doesn't seem right. I mean, it could be. We can, we can see where that lands us. That might just be enough for one. I might, the math in my head doesn't seem to add up right now. And that might just be because I'm being stupid or because I just... What, everything I said went in one ear, not the other. So we get the Evertide Amulet. It's going to tank our EMC, but that's just because we get this back after we craft it, right? Because that's an infinite water source. Yeah, this is enough for, like, a very small amount of them. Uh, it's enough for... How many? Because that... It's going to require, so it's one overclocker, that's two overclocker, so that's enough for two overclockers, so we're actually going to need 10, we need 48 more, so we want to do that, we can do that, right, and that's 48, 10, yeah, and then we can do this, so we can do boom, 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 okay, come on, split evenly, there we go. And then we can throw you right back in there, because again, expensiveness. And we can do the, make the overclockers. Uh, boom. Boom. So that's six. So in theory, I should be able to do that. If I do this. Okay, so what's the issue here? Why is this not working? Because it's two of them. Oh, I might need the industrial work table. I'm assuming. What are you going to need? Oh, no, how do you craft with... Yeah, I don't understand how you craft with some of this stuff. Like, that's... It shouldn't be a thing in the normal crafting table. Oh, there we go. Cool. I don't know how that worked, but cool. So now, right, what I should be able to do is throw you into here. Right, charge you up right there. Oh, why can't I uh, cycle through different modes? B? Do I have to do it on the tool? Burn tool mode normal. Okay, so yeah. Press B to cycle through different modes. I'm pressing B. 
Okay, well, why can't I charge you in here? Is it because you're too high of a tier to be charged in here or something like that? Hope that's not the case. Well, I know what should work is if I get a battery. We <laughs> do this the stupid way, but we can do this the stupid way. If I have a battery in my inventory that tr that drains into it, that should work. So let me get a, a tin for some redstone. And of course a copper cable. And I've already make myself a battery charge the battery and then drain the battery from my inventory into it that should work now it's a dumb solution to a dumb problem but you know that's the the best kind of solution to those problems right so you get me 10,000 EU you can hold a hundred thousand EU actually so wow it's gonna take a while but it says control for key usage uh, charge electric items when in not car or offhand can I Oh, it's not charging you. So what's the issue here? Press B. Why you no work? Are you fast even without? No, you're not fast without. So what's the issue here, bud? Why is this giving me an issue? Hmm. That's the yeah, that's different batteries. Those are different batteries. Um let's add gravity suite by then, I guess. Because apparently Gravity Suite's what mod this comes from. Not IC2. Um, so it looks like... I don't think we need nuclear jetpacks. Electric jetpacks for this. But we might need lap packs. That could be it. No wait, that's an advanced lap pack. Um, it could be that. We can try making a lap pack and seeing if that works. Which I need a bat pack. It's gonna be a bunch of rebatteries, and then red. Uh, we could try it. Yeah, sure. Why not? <laughs> I mean, we're just trying stuff out here. No harm and no foul in doing that because we actually are gonna need uh, one of these to, you know, continue this. So, okay. So cool. So, where are our um these guys? Cool. I guess we can waste a little bit of power. I don't give a dang in that regard. So tin, redstone. Uh, we actually need some copper as well. Okay, cool. So let's do that. That. I'll do this. Do this. Do this. Cool. That's, that's pretty good. Right, so bat pack. I need... Oh, I need a refined iron. Gonna need a one of... That. Okay, cool. And we're going to need uh, five rebatteries. So let's get some rebatteries. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. And then to make a bat pack, it's going to need a tin ingot, which we have, which means I think we can make this. Cool, right? It has a little bit of a charge, right? And that's not charging this yet. But if I, were to I could basically, what I'd do is I'd put this on the chest plate. And, you know, that's what happens there. Now, lap pack. It's going to be a little bit different. We need advanced circuit. We're going to need some lapis blocks. So a lapis, as you know, normally you take it, you go like this. Right. Uh, block. Boom. Right. We're going to need, what, six of those? And an advanced electronic circuit, which I have. So we do that. Lap pack. And... I could throw that out on his chest plate instead. Now, what is this saying is it wants an advanced lap pack, which is a lapatron crystal, which can be an energy crystal, which actually Oh wait, there's ultimate. Well that's gravity sweet. The advanced lap pack is actually not well the ultimate one's more, but we don't think we need the ultimate one. Not yet. We can get we can definitely get the advanced one though. The advanced one's actually not hard. The advanced one we need it. We need it that and that's gonna be energy crystal. So yeah, that's just Diamond. Surrounded by redstone, which I think I guess an energy diamond, right? So, okay, energy crystal, right? Lapatron crystal is just gonna be what, uh, refined that, and I think it was redstone, 
right? For the boom boom. One. Uh, we are definitely going to need a little bit more copper. Just a small amount more copper. A smidge. Can we do that? Right? Make ourselves another electronic circuit. We have one of those. We don't need to actually make, worry about making one more of those. Um, so realistically, it's just the lappies now, I guess. One, two, three, four, five, six. And that gets us the Lapatron crystal. Which means, what are we missing? Is it just the lap pack, which is on my back? Which gets us... Boom. Now, if I, that doesn't empty into to this, I don't know what would. Like, if you think anything was going to, to empty into the thing I have on my back right now, manually, it'd be this, because this is like... Insane. And I don't know if it is. And the bat box should still be able to charge this. It shouldn't, like, it's gonna charge it slowly. Oh, it doesn't charge it. So that's the issue. Okay, so these are just too high tier for the bat box. Which means we're actually gonna have to get an MFE, I think. Right, MFE. Right, what's above an MFE? An MFU. What's above that? Personal MSFU. No, I think MSFU is basically the top tier. What about CESU? Is that an option as well? I see a CESU cart. I don't see a CESU, so I don't think they're in the game anymore. I think Railcraft just has that like stuck somewhere in his code. So we're either going for an MFE or an MFSU. Hopefully, it's just an MFE. We're going to try the MFE first. Um, Cool. Apparently what we made is just too powerful for us to charge right now. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually get Sticky Resin. Because I accidentally turned on this caps lock. And we're going to take the Sticky Resin and we're going to throw it in the extractor. Because we're actually running out of rubber for stuff like this. So throw you in there. Do you continue going? and take this stuff. I'm going to throw it in the table because it's free EMC. Yeah. Um... Cool, so we need energy crystals, so which means we're gonna need diamond. One, two, three, four. Means we're gonna need redstone. One, two, three, four. Oh, that's not enough redstone. That's actually like less than half of what we needed. So we're gonna do that. Do that. Right. And then we're gonna need um do we have machine casing in here? Can we get refined iron? To do this. Now I'm wondering, does this doesn't have an EMC value. That sucks. It really should. It's just refined iron. Um, double insulated gold cables. So that's where you come into play, and gold comes into play. So I believe if I do this. Okay. So I know I have to do it where this becomes that. So this. Okay. That becomes insulated gold cable. And now it becomes a double insulated gold cable. And now I can make an MFE. Okay, cool. Now if the MFE can't charge it, which is like the second tier, right? The bat box is like the low tier. This is like the second tier, right? If this can't charge it, then we're going to have to go up to um, the MFSU, which is the higher tier. I guess the highest tier if you want to be like that. So let's put down U. You're gaining power. Can you charge that? Oh, that that drains that. Okay, you can charge that, which means can you charge this? Okay, so we need an MFE, not an MFSU. We're we're safe for now, but this is gonna charge super slow because number one, power doesn't come out of here very fast. <laughs> I'm at 32 RF F a tick, and this can take in 128. And this needs a lot to charge, so it's either gonna be sitting here a while, or we're gonna need up our power gen by a lot, which I think is on the agenda but just not quite right now so here how about we do this we'll drain everything from the advanced lap pack into there it'll help a little bit and we'll we'll go just test out this guy's power right now because this is what we've been waiting for today yeah i want to see how this, how this thing tears through terrain should be fun hopefully hopefully let's see so we were down here i think right and then we turn down this way. 
we went down a little bit this way before our, our uh, thing was like, yeah, I don't got a lot more power left in me. So let's see what this does. Oh. This is nice. I mean, I'm not sure if I'm a fan of the sound effect, but it just kind of tears. Right? So, like... Yeah, this is actually really good speed. Uh, wondering what a fish to like a pickaxe enchantment, you know, would look like on this. I imagine devastating. Uh, and then fortune would be nice on here too. Yeah, this is actually really fast. <laughs> it's kind of really shredding through everything. Like, of course, it's not instant mining, but that's fine because having a brief second between what you're mining and like you know everything else is kind of nice because again that's like okay i don't do i need to break the next block it gives me that split second to think you know especially if like you're strip mining this nice oh yeah this is, this is real good this is actually insane i like this a lot oh oh my gosh yeah this is this is good this makes just my personal mining so much easier but i don't want to be on this for long because again it's like i know i said i wanted to do the turtles last time but like I want to, uh, it's like, ah, uh, there's so much I want to do that I don't know what I want to do first. And I get with that with every mod pack. It's like, uh, I want to do this, but I don't want that to nullify this. And I feel like I just got to get out of that mindset. Like, I can just do a cool thing with cool mod and just enjoy that without real, you know, even though it makes something I did in another mod, like, you know, kind of, uh, redundant, you know? I, I can just experience cool mod for it being cool mod. Although sometimes I feel like if it's super redundant, it's just going to be a waste of resources and time. Yeah, let's not do it. And we're out of power. Oh, that was so nice while it lasted, though. That was so nice. This looks, this feels slow in comparison. I mean, it's still fast, of course, or over wood. Yeah, of course, but... Oh my gosh, that was so, so, so nice. So, so nice. Okay. Yeah, we definitely got to get better, better power then. And I know how exactly how to do that, but it's not something we can do this, this episode, guys. It's it's gonna be a it's gonna be a build craft thing mostly mostly build craft I shouldn't say it's a build craft build because it's it's mostly build craft but it's for IC too in the end so yeah that's that's all I'm gonna say about that okay I'm gonna mine up these two ores here because we already know how fast this is I don't need to really test it out anymore I like it it's going to become our primary method of mining hopefully in the near future it just needs a few little uh, enhancements. Perhaps is the uh, correct word for me to say, yes, definitively, we're going to be using this for everything. And by enhancements, I mean it just needs power. We need to enhance the amount of power we're getting into our system before I'm like, yes, this is good. This is very good. So good. I'm happy right now. This is doing, it was doing me wonders, and now I feel like this is going actually really slow. What is this? So this is Galacticraft Aluminum? Yeah. Oh, god, get the car going off. Well, before I blow your brains out. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time where we do some good old stuff.